clerk terminate the executive session. Yes, uh, thank you very much. Um, I take, take up that meeting opportunity. Because basically, again, to me, it means you owe $100 in interest, but you only paid 20. It's, it's not a widely accepted accounting practice. In fact, it raises a lot of red flags for that very reason. If you owe $100 interest on your mortgage payment, you can't write off goodwill and future revenue projections and say, I'm only going to pay $20 on my mortgage payment. So it is a non-cash interest expense. expense. Okay, that's fine. But again, we get we have to get down to the bottom of it. Are they making the interest payments they're required to? And is there added interest on top of what they're not paying? Now, that's the fundamental issue, but I appreciate the digging. At the same time, and everybody happy and having the lighting being completed. It looks like the date now is set for 6.15 on Saturday night, October 6th, to coincide with the first Phantoms hockey game. Now, there's going to be a meeting about this. I was told, uh, they asked me if I, I said I'll come, but I don't care anymore. I just want to do it. <laughs> I, I really am at the point. I stood here back in April going, Memorial Day, we're going to, you know, then this day and this day, and uh, I apologize because if we're not paying, and the people are, get to pick the day, so, but it's worked out now. If I come before you in two more weeks to tell you this isn't the day, but I'd like to invite you all <laughs> to please come and be part of that, okay? I don't know how this ceremony is going to work. My whole thing from the beginning was I didn't want it to be ceremonies, just let's light it up. So. Mr. Reynolds, yes, uh, Executive Armstrong, I, I, I want to reach out to you. Uh, I was informed the other day that uh, former State Representative Joseph Zellers was celebrating his 100th birthday next month. Mr. Zellers was instrumental in saving that monument back in 1964, I believe. I think it would be appropriate if you could reach out to him and make sure that he gets a chance to participate in that line ceremony. I will thank you my best for that. I'm happy to have Thank you for the information. Again, they're saying that they might even do a plug in inside of the PPL Center uh, and put it up on the big screen. I'm not aware of the final plan. Thank you for Thank you. your patience. Is there a motion for adjournment?